Hey what's up YouTube and welcome back with another tweaks video in today's video I will be showing you guys and share with you guys some new tweaks that has been just released for those who already on iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.3.1 also the 11.4 beta 1 up to beta 3 most of those tweaks will be compatible. Before we start today's video, I will ask you guys to give the video a huge thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified whenever I release a new tweaks video. Okay, so let's talk about the first tweak, the MI device. What the MI device will be allow you once you install it in your device will be uh, make you to customize most of the things on your iOS 11 device. Back in the day on iOS 9 up to iOS 10, we have the Supreme Tomize from 1, 2, and 3, and the 4th version. The MI device right now, it will be same thing, but this one will be for the iOS 11. And if we jump right now under the settings, the first thing that you need to do to enable the tweak, and here you have more than sections. So we have the alerts and the app switcher, the control center, the dock, the folders, the icons, and the lock screen, notification center, and also we have the springboard here, and also we have the status bar so all those section every single section you can go through we have a lot of options for example if I show you right now my control center I already customized that and I put some color on it if you want to jump under the dock here section you can see we have more than option you can just play with those so for example if you want to hide the deck background use the custom icon count and more than that the same thing here if you want to jump on a status bar it will give you a lot of options so you can custom uh, the carrier you can uh, put your any kind of name that you like on your carrier text here and then it's going to be allow you to customize a lot of things on your device so pretty much as I told you guys about the MI device will be customized a lot of things on your device if you want to give it a try make sure to download the MI device. So the next see that week I will be talking about the mailer here and what is that week will be allow you it will allow you to customize the volume hood on your device. So to show you guys how is that going to be looks like if you want to set that tweak on your device. So pretty much it looks like the video hood but this one is going to be a vertical. And also it will allow you to customize and put some custom colors into the hood. Alright if we jump right now under the settings. So first of all enable the tweak and also we have more than section and options here if you want to uh, toggle those it's going to be up to you one of the things here if you want to uh, show the mute indicator and also if you want to allow to show the indicator once you will be use the volume and also here in the bottom we have shake hood on mute so you can toggle that and this is the way of that tweak and also if you want to go down here we have a ton of stuff so you can customize those as I told you guys if you want to custom the colors you can just toggle that custom colors here and then you can pick the colors that you want to set on your device and this is the way of that week so once you're done from everything the only thing that you need to do just make sure to respring your device so your device will be take the effect it will be apply all the changes and this is the way of that week so as I told you in talking about the miller here is going to be really beautiful if you want to install that tweak in your device highly recommend you guys to give it a try if you want to the miller. Alright so the next see that week we'll be talking about the windmill what is that week will be allow you it will be bring a home button into your device. So if I want to show you guys how is that looks like on your springboard, on your lock screen. So this is the way of that week. So this is the home button in, in the middle. And also we have the other toggles, which is if you want to uh, launch your app switcher from there. And the other one, if you want to just go back to the same page that you came from. 
So if we jump right now under the settings, the first thing, go ahead and enable the tweak. And also, if you want to toggle the home gestures, the other option, if you want to no force touch. And also, if you want to use the micro bar, the height switcher and the height back. So you can toggle those and you can just hide most of the things on this side, the up switcher or the other toggle, which is uh, hide the back space if you just change most of the things on that tweak you need to just make sure to reciprocate your device and after that your device will be take the effect and this is the way of that tweak once you installed in your device so as i show you guys this is the windmill go ahead and give it a try if you want to windmill Next CD tweak, I will be talking about the faster animation. What is that tweak will be allow you? It will be basically it will allow you if you want to launch any app or tweak on your device, it will be pretty fast. So if you launch that app, it will be came pretty fast. If you want to close it, it will be closed pretty fast. This is the way of that tweak once you want to set that tweak on your device. Under the settings, there is nothing to configure. That tweak will be work right away once you install it in your device. So this is the way about the faster animation. If you want, go ahead and give it a try. Faster animations. Next, see the tweak. Let me talk about the show touch. What is that tweak will be allow you? So you might see right now if I touch my device, this is a small tiny dot. It will be uh, pop up always once I touch my screen. The developer he already made that tweak for those who make videos using their devices to show other people for example or making a videos making a video game to show the other uh, people how is the things will be work on the device or anything this is the reason behind that tweak so if we jump right now under the settings we have three different options so you can toggle the off or show always or even if you want to choose the third option which is will be once you want to record your screen that dot will be pop up and also if you want to change the color for that dot or the touch color you can simply do that and also we have the slider to adjust the way of that dot go ahead and download the show touch so there you go guys this is the most that weeks that i want to share with you guys and once again if you like the video just make sure to give the video a huge thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified whatever i release a new two weeks video catch you with the next one peace